You guys might see something cool. Water. Brought to you in part by Water. What up everyone, I'm Gallon Havoc and I'm back with another unboxing because apparently packages just keep coming in. Why I say that is because packages upon packages have been coming in for me quite a lot in the past couple weeks. In between my crow unboxing and now, but anyway. Before we get started, I just want to give a shout out to Spirited Below, a clothing brand made by my good friend, Maddie. So yeah, the, uh, she does masks, shirts, t-shirts, uh, even a hat. Well, not just this hat, but hats. She does hats and uh, even masks for your COVID needs and uh, even phone cases. So yeah, hop over to spiritedbelow.bigcartel.com. I'll drop a description and you can go check her out for yourself. So without further ado, it's a package time. So let's open her up. It says Top Cow right on the uh, postage stamp, so I have a feeling what this is. Which blade? This is round two of their Kickstarter campaign. Where am I gonna cut this? Right here. They packaged it real good. Eventually. Cut this box into pieces. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Bam. There we go. First thing I see, of course, is bubble wrap. Witchblade Ringer. Extra large. Holy bubble wrap. Oh my god. Well, don't need that anymore. These are what knives are for. Look at all that. Look at all that good stuff. Hee <laughs> Gonna spend most of the video just unwrapping the damn thing. So let's start with the ringer, which I feel like is the t-shirt. Oh, 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 here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm not used to, like, the white seams. I haven't seen that in a t-shirt in a long time, or worn a t-shirt like that in a long time, but... There you go. That is really cool. That, that's like a classic Witchblade image, too. Awesome. All right. Next up are the little guys, and from what I'm seeing, there's some good stuff in here. I'll start with these, actually. This is the bandana. Which blades everywhere? Nice, though. What do we have here? Okay, I hear threads. It's a box. Oh. Oh. It's metal, whatever it is, but. Let's take a look at this. Here, get a good look at the picture. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. It's a full on makeup mirror. <laughs> well, it won't be neat. I won't need that, but it's a cool thing to have. Actually, I think I know just what to do with it. That's, that is pretty cool though. I do really like that. 
that broomstick's been there for the past couple of videos. Put it away. All right, now that's over with. Start with the smaller package. And there's an issue in here, which I'm all for. Oh, nice little coaster. I'll probably keep that one on my desk, honestly. That's where it gets the most use. A uh, sticker. That's another thing Spirited Below does is uh, stickers, or as she calls them, slaps. So slap it. Slap a purchase. Slap it like it owes you money. Yeah. Yeah. There's that sticker, which I really like that image. That is smexy. I might put that on my laptop. A, oh, postcard. Which is of the same, uh, it's the same art as the cover of the first Witchblade. Yeah, the first Witchblade issue, that's right. Yep, number one, right there. Very nice, very nice, very nice. I wanna say this is a bookmark. Oh, excuse me. You got Sarah right there, and I believe, yeah, that's the, uh, it's not Jackie, it's not Jackie as the darkness, it's the darkness itself in the form that it takes when it's not with the host, so to speak. Or it's like a manifestation of the host, pretty much. And, uh, there's the other side of it. Very nice image. Nice little door hanger. Not the kind of one you want on your kid's door, but. <laughs> it's the other side of it. I, I really like that. I like that image. Assets aside. <laughs> oh, hello. Two. Oh, right. The one's the print, one's the image. That's right. One's the print, one's the issue. There we go. So that is the variant cover of Witchblade. One and two? I guess. Actually. Ah. That's a, I knew I recognized that style. That's a Sylvestri cover. That's his work. And the print. Two print. Okay. Oh, a little, uh, okay. So there's, I'm gonna have to get another frame. Oop. I'm gonna have to get another frame, like I did that one. But look at that. That's nice. That is Michael Turner. Yes, that's Michael Turner. Awesome. And a nice little 2021, 2022 calendar for your wall nice I still won't know what day it is but <laughs> All right. now for the big boy oh boy and I was aching to read this because of where volume one left off. Left much to be desired. Not saying it was bad, it was great, but comics and their cliffhangers. Woo! 
that freshly packaged smell. Oh yes. Eh. Who doesn't love a girl in black leather? This is uh, issues 25 to 50. Hey, there it is. There's another one. Mark Silvestri's signature. Thanks, Mark. <laughs> oh, I love it. Just want to take a quick skim through this. Try not to read any dialogue, just looking at the images and, oh, I'm excited. So that about wraps it up. Uh, another great, 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 great package from the guys at Top Cow. Awesome collection. Love Witchblade, that, as I've said before. I'm going to need a lot more shelving. <laughs> Just awesome, I, I can't stop smiling. <laughs> if you enjoyed my unboxing, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, share, all that jazz, comment if you like. Um, they do sell the uh, the hardcover copy, or is it hardcover? Yeah, they do sell the hardcover copies in your local comic store, so be sure to look at there if you want them. Um, but yeah, so. I am Gallant Havoc, and I'll see you in the next one.